Allah Azza wa Jal himself, who has all resources available to him, he creates all resources. And the effectiveness of the resources he determines is. But then still he tells us that in whatever he wants to do, with or without resource, number one, there is irada. There is a desire, there is will. Innama amruhu idha arada shay'a an yaqula lahu kun fayakun. As for the work of Allah and the way he does his things, anytime he wants to create something, it's just enough for him to say, be and it is. Even with Allah Azza wa Jal who created all resources and determines the effectiveness of those particular resources, the Quran says, Iza arada shay'a, when he wishes for the creation of something, when he desires for the creation of something, wish and desire is as a result of choice from many. And for that matter, there is hidden planning once there is a choice over there, there is hidden planning and there is hidden calculation and hidden prescription and hidden determination. So you as human being who has no resources at all, why don't you plan? Why don't you make a choice? Why don't you determine? And why don't you calculate? And you just get up and you do something to let you understand, Allah tells you in Quran chapter 54 verse 49 again that inna kulla shay'in khalaqnahu bi qadar definitely for everything that is in existence events and everything that is in existence matter and for that matter before it comes into existence, Allah says everything of it is being determined with a prescription, with a determination, with calculation and plan. So by these divine principles of Allah Azza wa Jal, we understand him again that wa khalaqa and he created everything wa khalaqa and he created everything faqaddarahu then he determined for it taqdira all that will entail in that particular creation from raw material to the formation to its existence and the effect and its non-existence everything is being determined by Allah in the creation of Allah all that he wants you to know is that he wants you to know his power of determination why don't you plan for your life if Allah, who creates and owes all resources, plans for his life, why don't you plan?